oh Jesus, that was the shortest prayer that I have ever prayed. Carol Mills only had time to say those two words right before this unexpected turn of events oh. came crashing down on her. It looked like the truck was going to flip over backwards and reminded me of those Transformer movies. She and her daughter were traveling from Pennsylvania to Florida to move into her new home. Mills was driving on DC 295 when a pedestrian bridge collapsed. Police say the driver of this truck forgot to lower the subframe when it pulled down bridge 66. It was like this huge thud. You couldn't see anything. The car was being jerked. Mills and her Honda Accord was right behind it. I, I couldn't believe that the bridge was sitting on the hood of my car and the sign was right in front of, was right in front of my windshield. Five people including Mills and her daughter were sent to the hospital. They were released that same day with only minor bruising. A stranger even drove them to rent a car. Just one of many kind gestures forever shaping her view of DC more than the incident itself. There were all different kinds of people. There were black, white, there were brown, and it made no difference. The compassion and the caring that um, everyone showed to us, um, that's what stayed in our minds. She's made it to her new home, starting a new chapter with more gratitude for others and God. It was by the hand of God that we were, if that truck would have hit us dead center, it, it would be a completely different story. Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.